Wall Street veteran Bernie Madoff has been arrested and charged. Men plead guilty to ripping off investors fifty billion dollars. We lost everything. We are major crime victims. Bernie Madoff stole every dime we gave to him. He got caught and he's behind bars. You have to stand for something, and you have to be able to fight for what you stand for. Late 99, Frank comes back from New York. He hands me a marketing document. The money manager was Bernie Madoff. It looked like nothing from finance that I've ever seen. You don't get straight lines in finance. If this guy was a baseball player, he would be hitting a 964. It took me five minutes to figure it out. This was explosive. This is going to rock the world. It needed to be stopped. I figured anybody who was stealing that large, if he found out about us, that could have been dangerous. This was a very powerful man, and the chairman of NASDAQ. We began building an intelligence network. I would say, what do you know about Bernie? And they would come back, what do you know about Bernie? We would try to push the SEC into action by making it public. But someone higher up at the journal killed this story. We weren't even the last line of defense. We were the only line. Oh, Harry was fearful for his life. Carrying a gun, not a normal dad thing to do. Obviously, first of all, this conversation never took place. One guy led you to this pile of dung that is Bernie Madoff and stuck your nose in it, and you couldn't figure it out. Someone at the SEC was paid to look the other way. I'm not participating in the current investigations due to the fact that a former employee married a member of the Madoff family, and I attended the wedding. He had a lot of powerful people standing to gain a lot of money. I was like the boy that cried wolf, but there was a wolf. Wall Street's so corrupt, I want to go against these guys. This is the biggest international conspiracy of modern times. The basic concept of Wall Street is by benefiting one person, you're disadvantaging another person.